If you're struggling to create listing descriptions, you have to stop outsourcing and going to Fiverr because it is causing you tons of money and you're losing tons of time going back and forth. In this video, I'm going to be showing you the best ChatGPT prompt to use to create your listing descriptions so that you can take your descriptions to the next level. But before that, make sure to hit that like button below if you're excited to start using AI in your business. Now, unless you're living under a rock, you must have heard of all the craze recently around artificial intelligence. But then that raises the question of how on earth does that relate to my real estate business? Listen, artificial intelligence isn't going to replace realtors anytime soon. But what is going to happen is that you're going to be replaced by someone that is using AI now. So it's best that you learn how to use AI in your business so that you can become more productive, generate more results, generate more leverage on your activities without having to hire an expensive assistant. Or if you already have an assistant, this is going to turn your assistant into a superhuman. Now imagine this. Picture someone putting a USB drive into your best friend. And then within that USB drive had all the information on the internet available to you. And now when you ask your, your best friend for any questions, they can instantly spit out amazing results in seconds. That is what ChatGPT is. That is the power of ChatGPT. You can literally ask it almost anything and it'll spit out answers for you. And you can also, if you want to get a little fancy, tell ChatGPT how to ask it questions. So you're pretty much using the AI to learn how to ask AI so you can get better response because right, ChatGPT is a garbage in, garbage out. So whatever you put into it is exactly what you're going to get out. So if you're not asking the right questions, you're not going to get the best results. There's so many AI tools that you could use aside from ChatGPT to 10x your productivity, such as Quillbot, Compose that AI, Jasper, Get Munch, Video AI. There's so many other tools that we could cover. But for now, I'll just cover with you guys some of the best ways to use ChatGPT to leverage your productivity, whether you need it for listing description, to create a client appreciation event, to create closing gift ideas, to respond back to emails with other realtors. Like this will help you with so many different ways. This will help you with so many different tasks in your business. You're not going to know what to do with yourself with all the free time that you just created. So now I'm going to show you the best prompt to use to create your listing descriptions so that you can make the most amazing, most compelling, most enticing listing descriptions on the planet. Let's get right into it. So what you want to do is you want to go to Google and then you're going to type in openai.com, openai.com. This is what their website looks like. Now you're gonna scroll down to the bottom where it says ChatGPT and where it says try ChatGPT, you're gonna click here, try chat. So a lot of realtors ask me, which ChatGPT is the real one and which one is the right one? So OpenAI owns ChatGPT. So if you go to openai.com, that's where you'll find it. Now it is free to use, but they do have a paid upgrade that currently at this time is 20 bucks a month. So I'm gonna be teaching you guys through the free plan so that you can also use this without any excuses because it costs nothing to use the free plan. Now I'm gonna show you a quick example. So I'm gonna tell ChatGPT to create a quick listing description for me. I'm not gonna ask it anything fancy. So create a listing description of a two story colonial. And I'm gonna press enter. So now I didn't really give ChatGPT much to go off of. I just gave it a very general prompt so I asked ChatGPT to create a listing description for me. And now that it's done generating, look what it came up with. Welcome to your dream home. The stunning two-story colonial residence effortlessly combines timeless charms with modern comforts. Nestled in a peaceful neighborhood, this meticulously designed property exudes elegance and offers a comfortable and spacious living experience. Let's explore the captivating features of this extraordinary home. And then it goes into the exterior, the main level, upper level, the outdoor race, oasis, additional features. Now... As you probably already know, this isn't going to fit an MLS listing description, but I just gave it a generic prompt and then this is what it gave me. So if you don't ask it exactly what you need, it's just going to give you what it thinks you need or what it thinks you're asking for. Now, you pretty much have one of two options. You can either refine it and ask it more questions to get down more to your specific needs, or you can just ask it a better prompt so it generates a better response from the get-go. So now I'm gonna ask ChatGPT create, to create another response for me, but this time I'm gonna use a better prompt. 
So if you already liked the video and you want to see my list of best chat GPT prompts to use for your real estate business, then make sure to comment below to let me know that that's something that you guys would want and I'll gladly hand it over to you guys. So make sure to comment below. Let's get right back into it. Alrighty, so now I'm going to copy and paste the new prompt, craft a compelling list and description for a unique, and then enter the type of property. Let's say colonial. That's coming on the market soon in, let's say, New York City. Highlighting its square feet. Let's say it's 1,500 square feet. Let's say it's 0.5 acres. I don't know if that's even realistic in New York City. Floor plan, open concept floor plan. I don't know. Three. All right, we're going to put three bedrooms here, two bathrooms, number of levels. Let's say two story. List of nearby attractions. We're going to put, what's in New York City? Times Square. I'm going to say, and insomnia cookies. End with a compelling call to action that entices people to see the property in person right in under 125 words. And boom. Now I'm going to copy and paste this into ChatGPT. And now let's see what it comes up with. Alrighty, and then second, here's what it came up with this time. Welcome to the epitome of urban living. This is a one-of-a-kind colonial gem. It is about to hit the market in the heart of New York City, boasting an expansive 1,500 square feet. This home offers a unique blend of elegance and modern modernity. I don't even know how to pronounce that. <laughs> the open concept floor plan seamlessly merges the living, dining, and kitchen areas, creating a captivating space for entertaining. With three bedrooms and two bathrooms, there's plenty of room for your family or guests. Spread across two stories, this residence provides the perfect sanctuary amidst, amidst the bustling city, located just minutes away from Times Square and Insomnia Cookies. The lure of the city life is at your doorstep. Don't miss the extraordinary opportunity. Schedule a viewing today and experience the urban lifestyle at its finest. So this is so much better than the last gibberish you came up with. This is something that you could actually most likely put into the MLS. Now, I want to make a quick disclaimer. Now, ChatGPT doesn't really know about fair housing laws and things like that. So you want to make sure that you proofread everything, every single thing you want to proofread. Right. Don't assume that just because it's AI that it knows everything. You are still the professional. This is not taking away your job. This is amplifying your job. So it's going to take away all the time that you would normally spend ideating. Or if you hire people on Fiverr to write your list and descriptions, this is going to save you tons of time and money. Now, all you have to do is make sure you just proofread it. And if it looks good, boom, you're good to go. Now, you can take this one step further. So ChatGPT just created a listing description for you. But if this were to pass an AI scanner, it would probably pop up as 100% AI generated or 98% AI generated because they have scanners out there that can scan whether something was written by a robot or by a human. So what you want to do is you take the chat GPT generated response that we just got right here. We're going to copy it. And then what we're going to do is we're going to go to quillbot.com. Quillbot.com. It looks something like this. Now, this is also free to use. It has a paid plan, but I'm showing it to you on the free version so that you have no excuse to use it. So you're going to copy and paste your chat GPT prompt into it. Boom. And then you're going to hit paraphrase. What Quillbot is going to do is it's going to take the AI generated content and paraphrase it as if a human wrote it. And then if you were to scan it through a scanner, it wouldn't show up as AI generated anymore because it makes it look like a human wrote it. So now no one will be able to tell that you got your prompts and you forgot your, that you got your listing description from ChatGPT. So now here's the new response that Quillbot generated. Welcome to the pinnacle of city living. This one of a kind colonial treasure is about to hit the market in New York City. This 1500 square foot home offers a distinctive blend of elegance and modernity. This open concept floor plan Seamlessly integrates the living, dining, and kitchen areas, resulting in a captivating and entertaining space. There's plenty of space for your family or guests with three bedrooms and two bathrooms. This two-story residence provide the ideal sanctuary in the midst of the city. The lure of city life is right outside your door, just minutes from Times Square and Insomnia Cookies. Don't miss out on this one-of-a-lifetime opportunity. Make an appointment today to see it for yourself. Boom. Now, no one will ever know that you got it from ChatGPT. And the best part about it is, is you could paraphrase individual sentences, right? If you click, hover over a sentence, it'll pop up and say rephrase. Now you can rephrase these sentences to something entirely different. So boom, a click, and just like that, it changes it for you. Just like that. 
And then from there, you could take it one step even further. Where you see check grammar, this automatically uploads it to the grammar person. You can rephrase your responses. And now if you see up here where it says synonyms, if you, you can move this to the left or to the right. And so if you have it more to the left, it's going to change fewer words. It's going to be more accurate. If you move the thing over to the right, it's going to have more changes and it's going to be a little less accurate. So you want to make sure to read it. But to take this even one step further, after you get a response that you like, on the bottom, you'll go to where it says check grammar. And then Quillbot also has a grammar tool similar to Grammarly. And just like that, now it's going to show you all the grammar mistakes that it has. It's going to allow you to easily replace them with simple clicks and boom. And now for the most part, you're good to go. You just have to make sure to reread it so it abides by all the laws in your municipality or your province or your county or city, whatever. And that's how you can use it to create your listing description. Now, this is just one of the ways you can start using ChatGPT to 10x your productivity. And you can also use it for your social media, which is a video for another day. But in the meantime, if you want to learn how to get more engagement, click on this video right here because this is what YouTube wants you to watch so that you can take your social media to the next level. See ya.